What's up, YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. Happy holidays to everybody. Be safe and enjoy. And we gonna make 4th of July cheeseburgers. Now you guys saw Ashton, but we also have a good friend of mine, Ebony, in the house. And she's gonna help me make these burgers today. So these burgers will be Ebony style. <laughs> All right, we got some um, olive oil right here on the griddle. Need some tongs. So right now we're about to saute some mushrooms and some what, Ashton? Onions. That's right. You got it, AJ? I'm nervous. You nervous? <laughs> you got it. I've never touched before. All right, I went ahead and uh, flipped it over to the grill side and I got that preheated, uh, preheating at 410. And now I'm about to uh, mix up the burgers real quick. All right. We're gonna use one egg and one packet of onion mix. Preferably the Lipton, but I have the off brand right now. That's what was in my pantry. All right, so that's the ground beef and now we're gonna put in our onion mix and I'm gonna crack an egg in one egg in there all right so basically you just mix everything up mix it up nice and good AJ bust down the mix okay <laughs> how does it feel my good. It feels nasty. Mm-hmm. We'll keep going. Ah. Get used to it, son. <laughs> you smell this? <laughs> okay, that's good enough. Yep, thank you. <laughs> now, I'm not going to put any salt in there. That's optional for you to do, but the onion packet is has a lot of sodium in there, so... I'm just going to add a little bit of garlic. Well, not a little bit, but some garlic. I like garlic. And a little bit of some black pepper, of course. I'm going to mix that up. And, and then we'll just form our patties. I'm going to use these to form my patties. Never had them. I've had this for like a year, and I've never put them in any of my videos. So I'm going to do that today just for fun. And we're just going to put the cover on. Alright. The burgers came out pretty good. Alright guys, I dropped it down to about 350. And uh, we're ready to rock and roll. You know what? I'm just going to do these three. They're pretty big. I'm going to put the cover on. Then I'll smash them down a little bit. It's cool. Alright, just did a flip. Gotta love those grill marks. Alright, ask them to go ahead and pat that down. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I already did that one. Yeah, I'll do that one. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to do the end. Yeah, I don't want to do that one. I don't want to fat doggy. Cover back on. Alright, this is my two quart pressure cooker, y'all. Special guest, I made some thighs. I'm going to shred these up into. Um, uh, pulled chicken, the barbecue chicken, 
And I'm gonna add that to my burger as well. So, once your juices are clear, you're done. I checked it in the middle just to check, but I don't even need to do that. But once your juices are clear, you know you're done. So we're done here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this to off. And um, yeah. All right, well, excuse me, Ebony. Well, we're just gonna have to do this part Doug style. I need you to go ahead and do uh, mozzarella first. We gotta hit him with some mozzarella. And then we're gonna hit him with some sharp. You're now into Doug style. Look at these guys. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. All right, so this is my pulled chicken right here, y'all. And it tastes super yummy. From frozen, I did it for about 20, 25, 20, I think it was 27 minutes. Awesome, in my two quart. And of course we used some of this, which is awesome. Also gonna make some seasoned fries. If you haven't tried these out, these are the bomb.com. I'm gonna put this in my air fryer for about 14 minutes. All right guys, AJ is hungry. He cannot wait. I just wanna show you what it looks like. He eats his burger with no bun. You want ketchup on it or are you good? I'm good. So you don't need nothing else on it? No. All right, well, give it a taste and let's see how you like it. Mm. <laughs> you know, how does it taste though? Give me your honest opinion. Good. Okay, let me let you finish chewing. Okay, now that you finish chewing, <laughs> how does it taste? Awesome. Yep. Okay. Now you can eat the whole thing. Yeah, you can eat. You're free to eat, son. Because I'm going to make my own burger now. All right, this is my hamburger bread. Get that out. Now, to complete Doug style, we got to add some jack cheese to the bottom. Okay, it looks like Miss Ebony is refusing my jack cheese. She says she doesn't want to be on fire tonight. So she's only going to get half of Doug style. Oh, well. So this is going to be the rest of the stuff that I'm using. Got some, uh, yeah, well, I already showed you all of that. I had some bacon that I made earlier. So yeah. All right, let's build the bear. All right, so I'm going to add some ketchup. That's our onions. Alright, so this is, we added the mushroom. Alright, and finally I'll put the uh, pulled chicken on top of the buns. And actually what I forgot to do, I wanted to put the bacon on the bottom, so I'm going to flip it after I put the um, pulled chicken on and put the bacon on the bottom. Alright, got the chicken. It's looking good, guys. This is what we're looking like. I'm going to cut it in half and we're going to see what it looked like. All right. This is the finished product, guys. I'm going to put my fries on there and we're going to take a bite. In fact, I'm going to pick it up a little in a second and show you closer. All right. So you see the fries. So let's pick up this burger. Oh, almost got away from me. Oh, 
All right, guys. You take a bite first. All right, I'm going in. Hmm. Yeah. That's a big burger. I know I'm gonna have to sit down and enjoy this. Take a fry. Mmm. You gotta try those fries, man. Those fries are really good. Well, that's about it, guys. I wanna sit down and enjoy this. Um, one thing I want to mention before I go, um, I do have a, um, a grilling uh, Facebook page. It's called Grilling and Chilling, where we have a bunch of indoor grills. No matter what you have, George Foreman, Cook Essentials, DeLonghi, DeLumphy, whatever you call it. Um, whatever you got. We just grill a whole bunch of indoor grilling in there and share recipes, good practices. I'll put the link in the description and definitely join. We would love to have you. And, um, yeah, hey, hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. And if anything, thanks for even just looking at my video. AJ, say bye. Bye. See y'all later, and happy holidays.